Hi, my name's Ernie, and I'm a student at the University of North Florida, and uh, uh, my major is psychology. And uh, um, I'm here today because I'm going to, uh, I want to talk about Open Book, which is a, um, it's an adaptive program used for blind people, um, which utilizes the scanner to read documents, um, type documents. And it can be anything from a school paper to a, like a phone, uh, a bill you get in the mail, um, you just uh, stick it under your scanner and it'll read it to you. I was trained in this program, uh, uh, for this program by Denise um, in 2004, and uh, she's, uh, she's really helped me out with this uh, a lot. And it, it, the program's been really helpful for me utilizing um, school stuff, personal stuff, um, you know, you get it. And now I'm going to do a little, uh, a brief demonstration of uh, Open Book and how it um, operates. And, uh, for right now, I've got a <clears throat> I've got a type document it's from school, and I'm just going to stick this face down under the scanner, or in the scanner, face down. And now I'm going to go to Open Book, which is on my desktop. Oh, Open Book 7.0. And I'm going to enter there. Enter. And this is taking a few minutes to. Kick in a little bit. Welcome to Open Book version 7.0. And now I'm just going to pre press the space bar to start the scan. And this will take a few minutes. Makes a little thump noise. It's already started scanning. Scan page one. There it goes. Recognizing text. Page is upside down. Experimental design worksheet one. A psychotic experimental design. Okay, this is this is the document I just placed under the scanner, and it's reading it to me. Now, if I just want to read the whole document, I go to the num lock, and I press enter. Experimental design worksheet one. A psychologist and it just starts to read it down for me. Focus influences self-esteem. He randomly assigned. Now, if you want to stop it, you just press the control bar. Now, if you just want to go line by line, the people in this study keys. sit in a small room in front of a full-length mirror, so they would see themselves at me. Or to read the previous line, you just press the arrow up. One, a psychologist was interested in whether self-focus influences self-esteem. Okay. And um, now, uh, now I want to save the document. So what I do is I just go to Alt F4 and I close the document. Please note. And the dialog save box changes comes up. Untitled. Yes. Button. It asks you if you want to sh uh, save the changes. No. Button. Cancel. Button. Yes. Button. I want to. I want to save it. Select a file to save then, to. File name. Edit box document one. Okay. And you want to choose a name for the document. So in this case, I'll just document. say. Document. This is uh. I'll just say. P A P E R space. One. Okay. I just I title it paper one. Files of type. Combo box Arkenstone docs star dot a r k. It gives you a list of uh, uh, places to save it to, and I just save it to this uh, arc. Uh, uh, what's it called? File name edit box paper with files of type combo box Arkenstone docs star Arkenstone dot a r k. Docs. I save it there. Save button. Uh, save it. I just press enter. And it makes that little music, and that's all through saving, and. Like I said, this can be really helpful. Um, it's helped me out with school. And sometimes it's just uh, letters I get in the mail, like bills and that kind of thing. I can stick it on there uh, using the scanner. And um, thank you.